Broadmead Care is hoping to raise $150,000 this month through its Serving Smiles campaign. You may have noticed the number you can text donations to at the end of our milestone celebrations every night. And in this week's Vital People, Tess Van Stratton shows us what the campaign is for and introduces us to some of the veterans it will be helping. Okay, Lloyd, here we go. Yeah, okay. Lloyd Leash was in the Air Force during the latter half of the Second World War. My ambition was to be a pilot but the war was half over and they weren't taking pilots anymore. There's one picture of me in the Air Force. He joined the military, did a lot of different jobs, but spy school was one of the most interesting and the most terrifying ones. I was so naive that I didn't even know what they meant by intelligence. Mercifully, the war ended before I actually had to do the job. Lloyd is one of the 150 veterans at Veterans Memorial Lodge in Saanich. By my impression is the best facility of its kind that I know of. The staff is, well, they just simply couldn't be better. Navy veteran John Little comes to Broadmead for day programs and respite care. It gives my wife, uh, gets rid of me, essentially. Gives her a bit of a so, break. Well, yeah, that's what it's all about. So I can just show you over here. You can see how oh, excessive yeah. wear and tear. But the kitchenettes and dining rooms, which are the center and gathering place in each lodge, are starting to show their age. We are having a lot of wear and tear over the 27 years we've been here. And particularly now with COVID and extra protocol and sanitation and whatnot has really put its toll on our kitchenettes. Help bring smiles to the people who live at Veterans Memorial Lodge. It's easy to give through Broadmead Care's Serving Smiles campaign. That's why Broadmead Care is hoping to raise $150,000 this month through its Serving Smiles campaign. I think it's very important to ensure that we look after these veterans who've actually represented our country in many ways and have actually been there for us. You can bring your donations to the Royal Oak and Esquimalt Country Grocer locations or text SMILES to 20222 to give and improve the lives of those who gave so much for our freedom, like Lloyd. Living through that depression, being the oldest of nine siblings, I was basically the boss from never as long as I can remember. <laughs> My father was a veterinarian. And I saw him being paid with pieces of harness and a bridle and possibly even a saddle or something, but never any money. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.